In polymer production, it's desirable to have a fast and reliable method to evaluate formula accuracy. Infrared analysis may offer a solution. This video application note illustrates the point by investigating polyurethane with different formulations using ATR sampling. Polyurethane comes in many different forms. Packing foam, seat cushions, lacquers, golf balls, and rigid wheels are typical polyurethane products. Basically, polyurethane is made by reacting an isocyanate with a polyol in the presence of a catalyst. Physical and mechanical properties of polyurethane products are dependent on the isocyanate and hydroxyl groups and their formulation ratio. In this application note, semi-rigid polyurethane samples containing varying ratios of isocyanate to hydroxyl monomers were analyzed via ATR. The first step in using an ATR accessory is choosing the correct crystal. Diamond, zinc selenide, and germanium are the most popular crystals for a wide variety of applications. Given the pliability of the samples investigated here and the high energy throughput across the spectral range, a Miracle ATR accessory with a zinc selenide crystal was used. To obtain an infrared spectrum, a background was collected on a clean crystal, followed by collecting the sample spectrum of the polyurethane sample. Let's look at the urethane IR results. Specifically, the point of interest is the isocyanate band located at 2260 reciprocal centimeters. This band indicates the degree of excess isocyanate monomer remaining in the system after the reaction is complete and may be used to determine that the proper monomer ratio is found in the formulation. In conclusion, the Miracle ATR accessory proves to be an important and easy to use tool to evaluate formulation accuracy in polymer products. Visit us online at piketech.com.